Virginia is now officially the first state in the South to make it legal to have marijuana. The new law took effect at midnight, but not everyone is excited about this big change. Both sides agree more work is needed. Alex Littlehale shares the issues those for and against these changes still have. It's confusing. Why can you grow and you can't get seeds? A big step today is by no means the last step. Today is just legalization. It does not help any of the people in my project in for consequences. Tamara Netzel tells stories through photographs. Her project titled Cruel Consequences tells the struggle some Virginians face living with marijuana charges on their criminal records. Virginia's new marijuana laws do not include expungement of all charges, meaning today is just another Thursday for many. You have to live marginalized lives because of their arrest. After they've settled with the state, after they have paid their debts to whatever the crime that the state says they have done, um, they are still marginalized. It's only one of the questions about legalization moving forward. The most troubling issue would be that of community public health. Dr. Mary Crozier is a former educator from East Carolina University and now a part of several community coalitions, including Virginia allies evaluating drug legislation. She says there are still too many question marks surrounding the drug, like its illegal status at the federal level and unknowns about its true impact on the body. We don't have the um, a formal sort of number for what dictates marijuana intoxication. But what if somebody goes into their work? In Norfolk, Alex Little Hales, 13 News Now.